expensive. Yes, from my point of view and from our point of view, it's really important that we know each other, everybody, what are we speaking about in this course. And so we draw up this word, but we start from the situation you have in your daily teaching life. You are in a learning institute, which is the Blue House, a learning institute, and you are teaching professionals who are working in guest-oriented businesses. Guest-oriented businesses that might be restaurants, that might be hotels, cafes, catering businesses, that might also be institutional households, such as hospitals, elderly people's homes, or children's homes, mensa, and whatever you think about, training, how, uh, buildings, or whatever. So, uh, most of the learning institutes who are teaching professionals in such kind of businesses, they teach them how to act in these professional fields in a professional manner. So that these businesses have benefit, economic benefit, and that the guests of these institutions or hotels, that they are sufficient, that they feel well and comfortable. This is the most important aim to teach professionals how that the guests feel well, can come back again only hospital. They should also feel well, but they should not come back. It's okay. <laughs> but in these other kinds of businesses, guests should come back. So we have to do the best for the guests, but also to do the best <coughs> for the benefit of the hotel, so that it makes profit, so that the staff can stay, they get employed, get lot of income. So now, with all the development in the world, we will speak about this today, we see that the impact, of not only of learning institutions, but also of every business, every household, every person in the world, has an impact on the world. So, I only say climate change, poverty, whatever you see. And now, our aim is that we not only teach the professionals to do the best here, but also to do the best for the world. So they have to reflect what is the impact from guest-oriented business to the world. In fact, what is also impacting them. So for example, if you have a hotel near the coast in Germany or Ireland or Finland, so in 20 years perhaps this guest oriented is not any more existent because of the oceans, they are going higher and higher, so they might be over flooded. So the impact of climate change is not only one to those, but also the most impact of these get on businesses to the world. And if you imagine how many institutional households there are in the world, if you could imagine this, how many, 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 millions or millions. And if there, each kiosk where you buy a hot sausage or something is a kind of get on business. And if all these places, if all these places would act sustainable in a sustainable manner, so that this can make a huge and immense impact. So we are we are here focus, a really wonderful focus from my point of view. If we start with this course, I think we'll distribute it at the end of the course. So perhaps in ten years we really can have an impact in these gas oriented businesses. And that is our vision. Yeah? So and now what we are doing this week we are considering, we are watching a lot on schools and training programs, whatever, what kind of learning situation you are. We will check aspects to consider theories, concepts, methods, competences and tools. This is our, this is our course dealing with. And you will, we will speak about it. So whenever you do not know at which point we are now, perhaps here or here or here, please ask us. This is our overview. Always can orientate at which point we are. So we will have this the whole week, perhaps a whole course, and we are discussing different issues here. But some, today we are discussing the situation of this world and how the situation to learn institutions and the world will be. Tomorrow we will see a lot of guests on teach business who are already on the way to change their behavior. Okay? Any questions on this? Thank you very much. Later. You will have questions. <laughs> <laughs> when we start planning, we always have to think about speak we from the perspective of a teacher? Do we speak from the perspective of a, of a student? Do we speak from the perspective of a business? And it's also necessary to clarify.
clarified it when we discuss it. Because it's difficult. We have three dimensions. Our details for the pro project, uh, we start one year ago in October and it will end next year. And our most relevant topics are environment and climate change, <coughs> research and innovation, and regional dimensions and cooperation <coughs> with businesses from Europe. Find my 
my peer group where I can find all participants and how this course goes on. You get on Friday an introduction, step by step, what are the things which you have to do or could do the next month. Okay, and now module two will be introduced by M. Fox. Okay. Um, so in module two, uh, this will be an opportunity for you, whereas you are here uh, talking to each other and finding out stuff from us and finding out stuff from each other, when you go back to your institutions, we'll be asking you to think about how to apply the, the various things in your own context. So we'll be asking you to think about your curriculum, to think about particular activities that you might like to even experiment with. We'd like you to be talking to your colleagues and management at your institutions. We'd also like you to be talking to your students. And we'd also like you to be talking to third parties, perhaps some equivalent businesses such as we're going to be visiting tomorrow, um, and other parties who could maybe help you to make your course uh, more uh, integrated. So this is an opportunity for you to um, put what you're learning in your own context. And we hope that as you build over the seven units, eight weeks, uh, that this will spark ideas for your project in Module 3. So, Module 3 will introduce by Daryl uh, Shishama. So, uh, it will be Module 3, so it uh, will also be online model, uh, but it will be rather different from the Module 2 because it will be done in a more practical way. Uh, so in the model number three, you will be asked to analyze your own teaching activity, uh, to um, write your lesson plan, uh, to trial it, and to um, uh, then evaluate. 